Welcome and happy holidays from 2K Sports. It's time for NBA action. We'll watch the Orlando Magic in this one as they go up against the Indiana Pacers. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Coach Mike Fratello. On our sideline, David Aldridge. And some of the rookies now getting their feet wet, Mike, in the NBA. What are some of the more difficult adjustments to make as an NBA rookie? Learning all the rotations and defensive nuances, off the court, the travel, being away from the family, and on and on. And do you, do you give them to it in, in small portions? Do you try to lay the whole thing out in front of them? How, what's the timing of things like that? And you understand, Kevin, that when the race begins, you got to stay up with the rest of the people or your horse is finishing last. <laughs> that's, that's a tough place to be. Here's Brock, and it's Kevin McHale with the finish. Look at McHale getting after it. Soar is opening and puts it down. Outside hood. And there's the pass to Gonzalez. McHale with the rebound. It's stolen by Gonzalez. Davidson passes to Hood. And the foul called on Kevin McHale. That's his first foul. First team foul. First quarter of play, one minute played. And Johnny Davis gets the whistle that time. That is his first foul of the game. Second team foul. Ball outside. Davidson passes to Hood. Five on the clock. The Magic again can't hit. And so it's Thompson with it. He'll bring it up for the Pacers. This game coming after a loss against the Bucks. Hey, sometimes you just got to take a foul. That's the best way to protect the basket. Yep, better to send them to the line than allow an easy layup. The Pacers shooting their first free throws of the game right now. First free throw is good. And good on the second, so he makes them both. And he's making them count at the charity strike. No surprise there. Coach, they're ice cold on the offensive end. Well, something has to change. Pass to Long. Passes to Davidson. Pacers with the rebound. And this game, the first chance they've had to see Orlando. The first quarter of action, two minutes in. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. Ball against Davis. Paul kicks to Long. Pass to Gonzalez. Some nice ball movement by the Magic. Lock at six. Hood, the pass to Davidson. Pulls up on the elbow. Here's Gonzalez. It's good. He scores. That's his first basket after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. It's simple. you got to get a body into your man. Box out if you want to rebound the ball. Defensive rebounding is about effort. Trying. 
being willing to put a body on someone. Here's Prots. On the pass to McHale. And Gonzalez pulls it down. He'll normally convert on that finish. The defense got lucky. Here's Hood. No good. That would have tied it. Indiana leading. Here's Thompson. And too long on the shot. Ball looking over the floor. Left side, Gonzalez. And he hits it to tie the game up. Gonzalez has got his second basket of the night. Well, that's an easy, effortless make right at the rim. Yeah, you know this. You, you usually get only looks like this in the layup line. The defense has to make it harder on him right there. Now, here's McHale. 17 points in his last outing. Second team foul. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. On the wing, Thompson. Just five to shoot from the baseline. And he knocks down the jumper. He saw his opportunity and went right into attack mode. He'll take those mid-range openings whenever they're presented. And to see him doing it at the start of the game is very encouraging for his team. Now here's Hood. Pass to Gonzalez. Here's the hook. McHale with the rebound. McHale's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Floats one up. It's deflected. Ball outside. Passes it to Hood. to the wing right side the 17 footer here's Gonzalez and he takes that one up and powers it through how about the effort on the offensive boards remarkable job Clark. the coaching staff really appreciates that hard work love it not just the coaching staff but his teammates do as well great work here's McHale Following the bucket by Orlando. Here's Brox. And Gonzalez pulls it down. Gonzalez has got his fifth rebound in this one. Hood kicks to Long. Pass to Gonzalez. And he banks in the layup. Gonzalez has got eight points. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly, that was their game plan coming in. Now the pass to Brox. The next foul will put them in the penalty. You have to be careful now. You don't want to give away free points at the line. Some changes for Indiana. Higgins is checked in for Thompson. And it's McMillan in for Davis. Here's Bratz. McHale outside. Higgins passes to Bratz. Here's the screen. And for Hood, Indiana needs to get a shot off. And once again, off the mark by Indiana. And so Hood will bring it up for the Magic. Paul kicks to Hood. Here's Long. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Paul, right side. Six on the shot clock. A step back shot here. Here's Gonzalez. Makes the bucket. Now he's got five field goals. Five for eight in the game. They don't hesitate when they get their opportunity to punch it inside. Here's Brotz. Now here's McHale. Out of bounds. Orlando takes possession. Now we get a chance to check out the standings out east already. We are in December. If you look at Orlando. Here in the middle of the regular season, they've been able to get the fourth best record in the conference. And checking out Indiana, quite a few spots down the ladder right now. Magic leading by four. There's the pick. Here's Hood. 
Here's Gonzalez. And the call on the shot that sends in to the line. First personal foul. Third team foul. The Magic shooting their first free throws of the game. Gonzalez. Two shots. Shooting two. And the first one at the line is good. Indiana making some changes. Washburn's checked in, and Neely subbed in for McHale. Good on both. Pacers trail by six. Time go here. Indiana decides to talk it over. A train with a strong contribution so far in this one. They simply have no answer for him right now. And he's making them pay dearly for it. Here's McMillan, 11 points last game, and he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Magic. First one falls. So he hits one of two from the strike. Here's Orlando now. They're on a 12 to three run. On the wing. Pass to Gonzalez. And that one is hammered home. A 
nice sense of when to move the ball and get the assist. The Pacers trail by seven. Pass to Garrett. Here's Washburn. Indiana moving it around. Here's Neal. Pass to McMillan. From six feet. Rejected by Gonzalez. Here's Hood. Not going to go that time. So the Pacers will take it the other way. The pass to Higgins. McMillan against Hood. McMillan passes to Washburn. Rebound by the Magic. Gonzalez has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. To the inside. The shot by Long, no good. Pacers shooting in the early going here. Pretty dreadful, 22%. Here's Higgins, defended by Paul. And now Orlando on the break. Hood, the pass to Davidson. Out to Hood. Here's Long. Out to the right wing. Outside Hood. Five to shoot. Takes a shot at the elbow. Got a piece of it. They recover it. Gonzalez. That's good. Pacers trail by nine. Pass to Garrett. They set the pick. And once again, off the mark by Indiana. Not a bad look, just in fall. Here's Long. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Outside Hood. Passes it to Gonzalez. That one goes in. And it's an 11-point Magic lead. They've been the aggressors right from the start, asserting themselves from the very beginning. Yeah, they're setting the tone, and they're doing it on both ends of the floor. So the Pacers call timeout their first of the game. So a new group on the floor for Orlando. And the Pacers with possession here. 11 point game. Pass to McMillan. To stop the drought. And it's Russell with the rebound. And so it's Russell with it. He'll bring it up for the Orlando Magic. Away from home on the road, what a tremendous game they had at the offensive end. And they ran their offense, dictating the pace. Hard to do on the road. There's a good screen. Singleton inside. Here's Chapman. Three-pointers off the mark. 
That might as well be a layup if you give him that much space. You have to do a better job of taking away space from him, especially when he's lining up at a three. Here's McMillan. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. There's the pass to Barrett. And off there, he misses his first shot of the night. Pacers trail by 11. They need to find a high percentage shot, Clark, to regain some of that confidence. I think they've gone too long without seeing one go down. And that begins to mess with your psyche. McMillan kicks to Garrett. Six to shoot. Here's McMillan. Here's the three. Offensive rebound. Washburn. And it's sent back by Russell. Pass to Barrett. It's good. And the Magic lead by 13. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. Garrett, the pass to Washburn. Here's McMillan. Passes to Washburn. Misses the baby hook. On offense, here are the Magic. They're on a 20-3 run. We've got 28 seconds left in the first quarter. Fades and shoots. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. Perfect pass there. Understanding how to set up his teammate. Garrett looking over the floor. Inside. It's deflected. Gets it off. And no good that time. And so it's Orlando. Their lead at 15 going into the break. Their strategy has been clear tonight. Work the ball inside, get shots in the paint, and now they are scoring with ease. And we'll be right back after this. If you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. Guys, we've seen the Magic really take control here. Well, they've been the more composed team. They've gotten quality looks, and they're playing under control. And on the other end, applying pressure and forcing mistakes. So the turnover differential's in their favor. Pacers trail by 15. Davis, the pass to Smith. The dish to Thompson. Climbing the lane. In the corner, McHale with it. Lock at six. Spins. Here's Davis. McHale. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. McHale's got his second basket of the night. A determined rebounder. McHale just outworks the opposition to come away with the second chance points. Pass to Gonzalez. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. The Magic have gone two for two in the game at the line. At the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for him. And Indiana making a change here. And he makes both free throws. Pacers trail by 15. Outside, Davis. Thompson, Thompson, Thompson. 
He kicks to Thompson. McHale trying to free himself. A second effort. And the officials call goaltending, so they'll award the best. Almost got there in time, but waited just a little too long. The Magic making a switch here. Long's checked in. Here in the second quarter with a little over a minute gone. Off spans from Hood. Here's Gonzalez. He hits it from nine. Gonzalez has got 22. So few players still even use the hook shot, but I think it's a tremendous weapon when you can master it and do it right. Here's McHale. A beautiful reverse layup. Eight points for Kevin McHale. Down low, McHale has a myriad of moves. Just so tough to stop. Left side, Hood to the middle. Gonzalez. Kevin McHale pulls it in. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Pacers. Trailing by 13. That game marks the first half of a quick two-game homestand. Davis finds Thompson. That one good for two. Love how active David Thompson is on the offensive end, especially when he gets near the rack. Outside Hood. Here's Gonzalez. And the rebound goes to the Pacers. Rocks the pass to Davis. Kicks to Thompson. 14 feet away. Rebound by the Magic. Gonzalez has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Here in the second quarter, we've played a little over two and a half minutes now. And there it is for him. Keep doing work inside. Close range looks like that will keep your lead safe. Stay on the attack. I agree. The defense has to shut the door on those kinds of shots if they want to turn this around. What's up? We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Here's Bratz. The pass to McHale. Tries again, and he sinks the layup. Kevin McHale. McHale's got ten points. Winning play there. Saw the opportunity to take a second crack at it. They set the screen. It's intercepted. Here's Prots. It's Davis on the wing. Pass to Thompson. Shot clock at six. Over Paul. Good work defensively by Paul. Magic leading by 12. Hood with it. Picked up by Davis. Hood kicks to Long. Hood against Davis. The 11-footer. Hood can't get it to go. Pacers trail by 12. Thompson passes to McHale. Over Hood. And McHale the basket on the assist by Thompson. And 12 points for Kevin McHale. McHale can put up points in a hurry, folks. So efficient in how he scores. Now a timeout called by Orlando.
and Orlando making a change here. to Gonzalez. Right wing, pass to Chapman. They get a hand on it. Down to five on the shot clock. They set the pick. That's short off the rim. Boy, you've got to be there defensively. I mean, that's an easy mid-range jumper that he'll typically drain. Outside, Davis. post McHale. He's got 12. Off the mark. Had a chance to trim it to single digits. Magic leading by 10. Here's Chapman. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. And Long gets it to go. Hey, it's as plain as pound cake. Keep it simple. They want to see how big this league can get. No such thing as running up the score at this level. Now here's Davis. Down low. Thompson against Paul. Here's Gonzalez. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. Hey, this is a rinse and repeat just like last game. He's had his fingerprints all over this one. Looking totally dominant. He realizes his strengths on offense and does a fantastic job playing to them and finding ways to stay hot. Cheeks checked in for Orlando. One shot. Pacers trail by 15. Here's Brotz. Outside, Davis. Smith passes to Brotz. High post, McHale. He dishes it to Davis. Indiana moving the ball around. Brotz misses off the left iron. Orlando leading by 15. Now the pass to Chapman. to the paint shooting foul as the whistle blows he'll shoot two free throws the Magic shooting their 7th and 8th attempts at the foul line tonight taking two shots shooting two No good on the free throw. Good on the second free throw. Pacers trail by 16. Pass to Higgins. Here's McMillan. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Passes it to Higgins. Clock at four. Launches a three. Orlando grabs the miss. Gonzalez has got rebound number 15 here tonight. Ball passes the Chiefs. Here's Chapman. Left side Gonzalez. Pass to Cheeks. Out to the right wing. Left side Gonzalez. Makes it off the glass. And that's 31 points for A Train. Playing well on both ends of the floor, stifling defense and dangerous O. That's a heck of a combo. That's what has built this lead. And a great job to get that angle on a tremendous drive. 
With the lead they have, you might think they'd start to settle, but they are still going at the rim. And the Pacers call time here. McMillan passes to Higgins. Here's McMillan. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Count that one. Yes, Nate McMillan. Magic leading by 16. And the pass to Gonzalez. To me, those are always hard calls for the officials. But I don't think he was set right there. I agree. But those type of plays can go either way. For Orlando, they have been coming through at the charity strip. They've made seven of their eight attempts. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Russell, he's checked in for the Magic. Barrett comes in for Paul. And so he hits both. Pacers trail by 18. McMillan passes to Higgins. Pass to McMillan. For three. And it's Russell with the rebound. Russell's got four rebounds in this game. Inside. Gonzalez. That's good. Gonzalez has got 35. He's been a big factor here in the first half, scoring in bunches. Here's McMillan. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. Nate McMillan is one of those guys that just provides outstanding leadership. A capable scorer who also rebounds, passes, and defends pretty well. It's his first trip to the line. And the first one drops. Clark, he's checked in for Gonzalez. Yeah. 
Nick Millen hits them both. And Clark has got the ball here for the Orlando Magic. They host the Kings after this game. That'll be the latter half of this two-game homestand. Here's Higgins. And he makes no mistake on the slam dunk. Incredible two-way play. Yeah, offense and defense. Steals lead to points. The defense doesn't have time to get set. Here's Chapman. Passes it to Chiefs. Clark outside. Shot clock at five. Nice move. And McMillan pulls it down. Pacers trail by 16. He hits that shot. His first of the night. Now one for six. And the defense no factor. Which is why he simply laid it in. Here's Chapman. No points in the game yet for him. The feed now to Russell. To the left wing. Ball stolen. Here's McMillan. There's the pick. Over Russell. Pass to Garrett. Here's Higgins. To the middle. Here's Washburn. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Washburn's got his first basket of the night. Gets the defender to sell out on the pump fake. Then flips it in. Clark outside. And no good. The dry spell continuing for him. Here's Garrett, defended by Cheeks. They get it back. Here's Neely. Nice fake, but the layup off the mark. Orlando leading by 12. Clark outside. And there's the pass to Chapman. Rebound by Neely. Neely's got four rebounds now tonight. 131 left in the first half. Some nice passing here by Indiana. Higgins passes to Garrett. Here's McMillan. This one for three. It's rebounded by Barrett. Orlando, they've gone 6 of 13 so far from the field here in the second quarter. Chapman, he's just scored his first basket with that shot, making him one for four. He does not lack for confidence. He should. I mean, this guy's a dangerous scorer. And out of bounds as the Magic will gain possession. And Orlando will get a change here. Fifty-five seconds left in the first half. Pass to Christie. Knocks it loose. And so it looks like the Magic will retain possession here. Boy, that's textbook defense there. Nice timing to get that steal. Yeah, the opposition has to be careful around him because he's skilled at swiping the rock away. There's 49 seconds left to play in the first half. Passes to Singleton. Now, here's Barrett. Six on the shot clock. 18 feet out. Pacers with the rebound. You know, the fact is, he's not a lock from there, but he was open enough to where he should have hit that shot. Pass to McMillan. There's the pick. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. And they get it back. Garrett, the pass to McMillan. Fires the three. It's rebounded by Barrett. And here is Singleton. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. That'll do it for the first half. Magic lead by 14. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. And 
as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. A-Train has been sensational. Already has racked up a double-double through the first half. We call that a stat sheet stuffer. And if he can carry that performance into the second half, he's going to have some monster numbers. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. Here's Brox. Thompson outside. McHale offside. It's not going to go for him. So Orlando will take it the other way. They led the game at one point by 20. Paul kicks to Hood. The pass to Gonzalez. Paul outside. Takes the three. It's rebounded by Indiana. Neely's got his sixth rebound on the night. Pass to Brox. Thompson against Hood. Fades. And Gonzalez pulls it down. And so Hood will bring it up for the Magic. They lead by 14. Here's Long. And the wide open shot from Paul. Orlando gets it back. Gonzalez, that's good. Since his last game, he's been a machine cleaning up every chance he gets. He sure is. These past two games, his energy level has been sensational. Whether it's a putback like that or a hustle place, he's been everywhere. And here are the Pacers now following the bucket by Orlando. McHale outside. Goes back up. That's tipped. He's it again. Orlando leading by 16. Ball passes to Hood. And now around two minutes gone by in this half. Outside, Gonzalez. Over in the corner, Paul. Outside, Hood. And it's sent back by McHale. Using that impressive wingspan, McHale reaches out and knocks away the shot. Pacers trail by 16. Here's Brotz. He kicks to McHale. Passes it to Brotz. Here's the lob to the hoop. Great communication on the alley-oop. Now, what should I call that? An alley-oops? <laughs> no. Whatever we call, it's two points. Now, here's Gonzalez. 37 points for him. Pass to Davidson. Over McHale. And it's blocked. You'll see the block from Smith about once a game on average. And boy, does he have an extensive reach. Davis in the corner. There's the pass to McHale. Here's Smiths. Some nice passing here by Indiana. Lock at six. Davis, the pass to Thompson. Puts up a three. The offensive rebound. Smiths. Outside, Davis. Back to Thompson. Rebound by the Magic. Davidson's got his fourth rebound in this one. Hood deciding where to go with it. Here's Gonzalez. It's rebounded by Indiana. Oh, and they need a basket in the worst way. I think they're forcing things right now, and it's why their offense looks so pedestrian. Here's Brotz to the inside. McHale, right side, goes back up, and it's Orlando with the rebound. Gonzalez has got his 20th rebound here tonight. Saw that coming. And there's a nice one-handed slam. Going way upstairs for the one-handed jam. 
major athleticism on display. And Clark graceful, too. So graceful. He almost makes it look easy. Sure does. Really, that dunk is a testament to his skill around the rim. Here's Davis. The Magic getting the button. Here's Brotz. Top of the key. A second chance effort. Got a hand on it. Good. The pass to Gonzalez. That was an easy call on that shot. Refs will call that one 10 out of 10 times. First team foul. And let's get your guys' take now on the hustle stats for the Magic. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And he can't hit the second. Pacers trail by 17. Thompson outside. Pass to Davis. Here's Smiths, defended by Paul. Smiths, good. Selfless play by McHale with the ball. Didn't like what he saw for himself, so he gives it away. Orlando leading by 15. Here's Chapman. Pass to Gonzalez. To the left side wing. Long kicks to Paul. Five on the clock. Here's Chapman. A putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Did not give up on the play. Fantastic energy. Which is what you show on all of these plays, Clark. Fantastic energy. Great job, though, following up that shot. Amen. Yeah, he turned a miss into a make. Nice shot by right, Thompson. Use the pick. Get space. Easy, smart basketball. Orlando, they've gone a lackluster three of nine from the field since halftime. Gonzalez passes to Davidson. Plays it up and banks it in. Davidson's got four points now in the quarter. Pacers trail by 17. Davis kicks to McKayla. Davis looking for an opening. Pass to McHale. Six to shoot. Pulls up on the wing. That shot is off. And Orlando will come the other way. Long pass to Paul. Salas down low. He has 40. Long. And McHale pulls it down. McHale's got his 16th rebound on the night. Here's Bratz. Feeds to Thompson. Rejected by Gonzalez. Now the pass to Chapman. And here's Gonzalez. Doubled by McHale. Chapman the pass to Law. Orlando moving the ball around. Here's Davidson. Pass to Law. The Magic need to get a shot off here. Offensive rebound. Gonzalez. That's good. Gonzalez has got 42 in the game. Well, you can't give him any room to maneuver on the board because once he does, he's going to make you pay. Timeout called the Pacers.
Here's McMillan. Passes it to Garrett. Here's Higgins. Here's McMillan. He's guarded by Russell. Shot clock at six. And it's sent back by Russell. Here's Ramsey. Over McMillan. The shot by Ramsey. No good. Here's McMillan. The end of the drought. And it's Orlando with the rebound. Russell's got six rebounds in the game. McMillan passes to Washburn. Here's Garrett. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Here's the screen. Here's McMillan. Here's Washburn. He's guarded by Russell. And stolen by Russell. Here's Ramsey. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. And the foul goes against Indiana. The Magic have been getting it done at the line. 10 for 12. Taking two shots. No good on that one. And Indiana making a change here. Neely's checked in. And he sinks the second. Pacers trail by 20. Pass to Garrett. Here's Neela. Here's Higgins. Garrett covering. The pass to Garrett. Just five on the clock. Can they get it? And Gonzalez pulls it down. Well, that's another low percentage shot. He's been settling throughout this game for those kinds of shots. Here's Ramsey. Up top, Barrett. Magic moving the ball around. Here's Singleton. Orlando gets it back. Here's Russell. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Well, there's a reason it was way off. He got fouled. Yeah, easy whistle. And he can't get the first one. Christie, he's checked in for Orlando. He hits the second from the line. Pacers trail by 21. Offensively, Clark, things have sort of fallen apart for them. And they need to recover as soon as possible. Slammed home, and they call the foul. He's headed to the strike for one more. 
This is what a floor general looks like. The vision and the pinpoint pass. For Indiana, they have shot a good percentage from the free throw line so far. They've made five out of six. Find the lanes. Find the lanes. One shot. Throw good, Garrett. Magic leading by 18. Singleton with it. Pass to Christie. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. 157 left in the third. Passes it to Barrett. Here's Ramsey. Let's it go with a three. Higgins grabs the board. And got to be honest here. I mean, he should have made that. I bet it's not going to affect his confidence, though. He's going to keep taking those shots. Here's Garrett. 131 left to play in the third. There's a screen. Pass to Neely. Launches a three. Cranes the three-pointer. Neely's got his second bucket of the night. With a shooter of his talent, you have to do more defensively. Really chase him off his spots. Ramsey passes to Singleton. Inside, intercepted. One oh three left in the third quarter. Out to the wing. Here's Garrett to the right side. The pass to Neely. And there are the Pacers with another bucket. There's 45 seconds left to play in the third. Here's Ramsey. He's guarded by McMillan. Ramsey passes to Singleton. Here's Ramsey. It's Barrett on the wing. Five to shoot. Three-pointer. The rebound by Washburn. Washburn's got his fifth rebound in this one. Higgins passes to Garrett. There's the killer two-handed slam. Turning up the intensity dial here. Trying to rally his team right now. Uh, you're right. That jam might be just what they need. Well, certainly lit a fire under the bench. Hopefully the guys on the floor are feeling it too. And so it's Orlando holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. They're pounding the ball inside, and that's where they've gotten their best production tonight. And don't go away. We'll be right back. With the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. Here's Chapman. Pass to Gonzalez. Hook shot. And he jams it with authority. Great effort to put that one right back. Clark, a huge impact for this team tonight. Yes. In control of the score and the momentum. Here's Prots. Goodbye, Hood. Shoots a fader. No good from McHale. And a bit of a shooting slump here. I mean, he can't seem to get anything going. As a coach, this is when you want to draw up something that gets him an easy look at the rim, or at least a chance to go to the line. And the shot goes in. That is super efficient, getting in deep and then taking advantage. Fourth quarter of basketball. We're about a minute into it. It's tipped. Here's Chapman. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. You know, Chapman is a solid go-to guy on offense. A guy who can really play either guard spot. I like his versatility.
And he makes the first. Davis is checked in for the Pacers. Both shots good from the strike. Here's Davis. Passes to Neely. Back to Davis. Lock at six. From 13. And good that time. Davis. Davis has got his first two points. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hurt you from deep. So you have to fight through those picks. Gonzalez passes to Chapman. Hood kicks to Paul. Back to Hood. Off the left rim and out. Pacers trail by 15. Here's Brox. Now Davis. Floats one. Got a hand on it. And that's out of bounds. Indiana will retain possession. Thompson, he's checked in for Neal. David Thompson. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Magic leading by 15. There's the steal. Here's Bratz. Takes it inside. Second shot opportunity. Rejected by Gonzalez, and he gets it back. Orlando, they've gone 2 of 4 from the field since we started the final quarter of play. Hammers the alley oop crew. Woohoo! Wee! <laughs> Gotta love the alley oop. Clark, wasn't that a pretty play? Oh, I could watch that all day. So much fun to watch. And yes, it's good. It's so difficult trying to keep Smith off the glass. He feasts on these second chance scoring opportunities. Now a timeout called by Orlando. And now we'll take a moment for our presentation of our player of the game, A-Train. You know, from the jump, he was on a mission. You could see it. It was clear. Going after hoops, no matter what the defense tried, they had a tough time stopping him. I think he could have predicted early on we'd be talking about him right here and right now. That's how good he's been. He sure has given this crowd a treat tonight. This kind of performance only cements his status as a fan favorite. Right now, I'd send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin. Well, during the last break, I heard Orlando's coach talk to his team. He loves the aggressiveness on D. He said, we're doing a great job of challenging everything they're trying to do. Stay active, talk to each other, don't let up. Kevin? All right, thank you, David. Stripped away. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Hood, the pass to Davidson. Five. Five. First personal 
Side hood. Pass to Long. Shot clock at five. From 13. Good work there as it goes. Well, it's really hard to come back if you can't get stops. You've got to figure out a way to stop the bleeding if you're going to come back. And he looked very comfortable on that one. Not a lot of resistance. And there's the pass to McHale. Back to Davis. He's looking for McHale and finds him. What a lob. My goodness. Now that's a pair of teammates on the same page. Well said. Going airborne for that connection. Showing great control and a soft touch to finish that play. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. First personal foul. Third team foul. The first free throw is good. He hits both from the strike. And it's the Pacers with the ball. 17-point game. Outside, Davis. Kicks it to Thompson. Six to shoot over Paul. And Gonzalez pulls it down. Magic leading by 17. Ball passes to Davidson, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. Fourteen foul. Shooting for Orlando. Two shots. First free throw is good. He's perfect from the line this time. And it's the Pacers with the ball, trailing by 19. Outside, Davis. McHale, outside. Down low, it's tipped. Now here's Paul. Pass to Hood. Six on the shot clock. Tries from 16. Pacers with the rebound. Here's Prots. Dishes it to Thompson. Over Paul. And that one hits back iron. On offense, here are the match. They're on a 14-6 run. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Pacers trail by 19. And here is Davis. Passes it to Brox. Thompson outside. They set the pick. 
Rejected by Gonzalez, and they force the shot clock violation. Great team. Magic leading by 19. Outside Hood. Takes the 13-footer. And McHale pulls it down. The Pacers shooting a pretty sorry 29% from the floor here. Thompson passes to Brox. Now McHale. Pass to Brox. Just five to shoot. McHale trying to free himself. The second effort. He takes it up and lays it in. That's the kind of look you're working towards. Nice play. The Magic have gone. Four of ten here in the final period. Not the time to go cold. Takes the 13-footer. They get it again. Here's Gonzalez. And they pick up two. Gonzalez has got 46 points. Boy, they look confused and lost out there. Just getting out hustled every trip. And there's no excuse for that. You have to show more heart when it comes to closing out plays. Timeout called the Pacers. Outside, Davis. And the pass to McHale. Back to Davis. To the middle. And Kevin McHale, the bucket on the assist by Davis. McHale's got 20. And you can count that one as a screen assist. The pit allows him to get free and go right to the rim. Outside, Hood. Dish now to Paul. Lock at six. McHale with the rebound. And so it's McHale with it. He'll bring it up for the Indiana Pacers. 17-point game. Pass to Brox. He lobs up the alley pass and slam dunk by McHale. McHale, long arms, great hands. That's a great play call. To the paint. Here's Gonzalez, and the shot is good. Gonzalez has got 48. As they keep expanding this lead, keep feeding him the ball. He's having a great shooting night, so yeah, I'd say getting him the rock is a great game plan. 
Mikhail kicks to Davis. From deep three-point range, it's deflected to the inside. Davidson, and a great assist by Paul as that one goes in. Paul's got three assists tonight. Man, he's got a lot of firepower right now. I mean, what a half he's having. I'm well, glad we got a chance to check out that fantastic drive one more time. And this is what you love to see. Up big, no letting up, keep on applying pressure to their defense. Here's Thompson. The shot misses. Some solid D from Paul. Orlando leading by 19. Pass to Gonzalez. And another one! And it makes sense why they keep running the offense through him. Proving how efficient he is. Trying to find a way out of this rut, Mike. Yeah, looking to regain some momentum offensively. Here's Thompson. Good work defensively by Paul. Not sure if he just ran out of gas or what. He's been awful ever since the second half started. Not even been a factor. Heard the pass to Gonzalez. And again! He's been a reliable <laughs> offensive option. Currently maintaining an impressive field goal percentage in this game. Pass to McHale. 143 left in the fourth quarter of this one. And he lobs it up toward the rim. Well, you can see all of the practice they put in to perfect that one. What a play. You said it. Making it look easy, aren't they? And even if you sense it's coming, it's hard to stop. Now here's Hood. He's tightly guarded. Paul outside. The pass to Long. Hood with it. Some nice ball movement by the Magic. Here's Gonzalez. And good! He hits it again. Winning in strong fashion. A relentless effort notches a W for the Magic. This one was never really in doubt, Mike. They stayed firmly in control of the game throughout. A total success story. I agree. Things were just clicking for them out there. And now, for the year, this is going to take him to seven wins. And we watched one guy all night long, guys. And look at the stats just confirms what a dominant game he had. What a night tonight it was for A-Train. I love the assertive play style he used on the glass. Snatching loose balls out of the air and protecting his team's possession. Gonzalez passes the ball. Here's Hood. Rejected by McHale. And they're able to recover. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. And now let's take a look again at that incredible rejection. And when you're behind in the game, that's what you've got to do. Contest every shot and get stops. So both teams making some changes here. And McHale gets double teamed. Here's McMillan. Off target from outside. A tremendous team effort, Mike, offensively from them tonight. Well, they've been unselfish, a ton of assists, plus lots of different scorers out there. Yeah, things you all appreciate. And it's Orlando with the rebound. Here's Chapman, and so it's Orlando taking this one by a big margin. Well, Mike, the fans here obviously going home very happy. They had a lot to cheer about, Kev. This squad played a great game. They did. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. So for Mike Fratello, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, and our entire 2K crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching this 2K sports presentation of the NBA. So long.